Over the years, there has been an increase in non-communicable diseases in Grenada. Health officials are saying that the consumption of fresh fruits, vegetables and water will go a long way in eradicating the majority of those diseases and in some cases, even reverse some of them. The Marketing and National Importing Board has initiated several programs to get people to eat healthy, including providing fruits on a daily basis to schools. Sales and Marketing Manager of the MNIB, Hannah Marshall, is noting a transition in purchasing habits of some locals. Yes, we've seen an increase, in particularly between the age group of, say, 18 to 40, 45. Um, between that age range and why I specifically choose that is because around that time a lot of people are more health conscious and um, through all the years we've, we've always been advocating for health, healthy eating and having a healthy lifestyle but I would say previously because of the non-communicable disease that has been on the rise a lot of people has been health conscious and thus we've seen an increase in a lot of people coming to MNIB to purchase um, fresh fruits and local vegetables, mostly green leafy vegetables included with their, their meal. And um, so far, it has been positive. I mean, we, we would of course like for more people to be more involved in eating healthy, but so far, we've seen that increase and we want it to continue. She added, persons are now becoming health conscious and local products are at a higher demand consistent supply of what their demands are. Uh, particularly, they look for, say, callaloo, spinach, uh, more of the, the high vitamin intake um, items. Uh, they look for fruits, fruit salads, and of course, these are very seasonal. So you may not always find it on the shelf. So a lot of them come in looking for specific items. But of course, we try to ensure that we always have a main consistency, a main consistent supply of, of all of our the MNIB continues to advocate for healthy eating as they believe a healthier nation is a wealthy nation. Renee Toussaint, GBN News.